we are getting ready to go camping. How's your cookies and cream? Good! Yay! The bladders for our water packs. I am cleaning them out with a solution of baking soda and lemon juice. Non-toxic and it gets all the bacteria and stuff out of there. set up a tent and we went to Dairy Queen. And look at that picture. Union Station. Wow. What about you? This tent was borrowing. Nice big tent, huh? We're borrowing this tent. Yep. It's morning. Kids are playing games and eating breakfast. We had a nice full moon last night. Oh. You can see the lights of Drome right over there. Making lunch. Refried beans with blue taco shells and mozzarella cheese. How's it taste? Good. And yeah, carrots. It's really windy right now. Yeah, it's quite windy. Where did we just get back from? Um, Who knows how to pronounce it? Tuzi Woot. Woot? No dead horses. That is bad because I want to see dead horses. And I had battery issues while I was trying to do Tuesday route. Dead horse man is good to drink your thing. Which I really like. Now we're warming up water to wash our dishes in our little pot over here. And there's our water jug, reverse osmosis water that we brought with us. And we got this freaking huge pump thing to go on top of it. So we can pump the water out and wash our hands. A uh, catch basin underneath it that only catches some of it. Better than none of it. My solar powered battery charger. Here's the dead horse ranch potties. We got showers in there too. Pretty cool. Washing it. More trash? Yes, there's more trash. Oh my goodness. It keeps blowing out my propane stove. I turn it down too low. It's a bit annoying. It's quite windy. Now, what dead horse ranch would be complete without live horses? Dragonflies. And one right there. Working on Junior Rangers while we're over here cooking dinner. It is windy. I'm sleeping on the blow up mattress. My wife's on the cot with the pad. And the kids got the queen blow up mattress with their sleeping bags. It's like a 10 man tent. We borrowed it from some friends because our five man tent is just too small now the kids are getting bigger. And a Eureka Blue Mesa 1610. So when they say five man tent, that means five average sized men laying right next to each other. No more room for anything else. We got a nice sunset going on over there. Sticks, dirt, and rocks and twigs. <laughs> cool. Got our campfire going. I cheated with a little Boy Scout juice. If you get sprayed by a stunk, you need a tomato bag. That is the only way to stop the stink. Did we just see a skunk? Yeah, you did. Yeah, I did. Last night. Over right over there. there. 
I locked this thing. What was he looking for? Water. Oh, okay. But as soon as I shined my light on him, he turned around and walked off. Did, did you bug him too much? No, I was just walking back to the camp. Okay. If you want it to keep your tent clean, don't walk in it with your shoes on. You need a mat by the door. What did you put in your tree? Um, I, in my stump, I was going to put some bamboo. Okay. And then I was going to put some bamboo. Maybe like some bamboo. Maybe 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 some bamboo. He has to raise the right hand. And who's a really good reader? Do you want to read and you're going to repeat after your brother? It's your brother? Okay. I can read. Oh, okay. You can say it with him then read the same time he does. As in Arizona. In the play park in your ranger, I pledge to help the park rangers protect and preserve dead horse rims, state parks, and verb with Verdi. Verdi River Green Ways. Habitat and wildlife, and to help keep the park clean and safe for visitors and wildlife. Very good. Well, our Arizona State Parks mascot is the Rocky the Ringtail Cat. He's part of the yeah, raccoon yeah. family. And every park you go to, I'm going to give you a poster so you can collect all the different buttons. You'll see which colors they are because rangers have many different job responsibilities. So Rocky is patrolling the Birdie River on this one, making sure the beavers haven't dammed up the river. So they have to kind of, he has to go along and clean it out and make sure people haven't thrown trash down and stuff. No fishing lines stuck in the water because it's dangerous for other animals. So each of you get a Rocky the Rainbow button. And like I said, I'm giving each a poster as well. We just finally got some back in stock. And there's a sharp pin, so be careful. So you get your own little poster so you can collect your own number. Two days of camping, three days of driving around everywhere. Never thought I'd be happy to be back in an apartment.